Hey, what's up everybody? Mana here with your daily stack of the content. Today we'll be trying to beat Grandmasters with Mass Void Rays. The, it, the last time that I did Mass Void Rays was like in February, something like that. So it's time to do another episode of that. I'm always eager to see how Mass Void Rays is going to work. I feel like Void Rays are always fun to, to see how they play out. Simply because they're very <laughs> underused in all of the matchups. They're not the greatest unit out there. But if you know how to use them, they can definitely be a strong unit. At least help you to survive or some. But nobody plays Mass Void Rays anymore. They've been double nerfed after the, like a double buff or tri even triple buff long, long time ago. And after that, not a lot of people started to use Void Rays. Especially not in Protoss versus Terran, which we are in right now. So a little bzzit, bzzit action in here for your entertainment. Hopefully we can beat some Grandmasters, that'd be fantastic. And since we are starting versus a Terran player on Oceanborn, this is uh, a good map for me to, to try this out. Because it's a more st a standard uh, map out there. So there's a good chance that I will survive long enough to at least get some... Uh, void ray action. I definitely need to uh, start mining gas as much as possible because void rays are very, very gas expensive. 150 for just one, and not to mention that I need to invest into a star, which is also 150, and I need to survive the potential reaper or double gas openings from my opponent. So let's see what this is Terran doing. One gas so far, double gas. Okay, double gas is actually good for us because we want to be investing to the void rays no matter what. And void rays are very good defensive units, they deal a lot of damage, so there's a good chance. That we'll be able to crush the Terran's aggression relatively easily. Well, <laughs> I'm going a bit ahead in here into the game, but that's what I'm, what I'm thinking. That's what I would hope to do. Uh, looks like he wants to make a factory. Okay, we're confirming a factory. It's always nice to see this factory, actually in the Terran base uh, instead of a possible proxy or something. So it gives us a bit more information out there, and we need to retreat now with the probe, not to lose it to a potential Reaper or just a Marine as well. Okay, we'll have to open up with a Adept first. I could even go for a Stalker first. Actually, no, let's go Adept. Let's go Adept simply because Adept is cheaper on gas. And I can also scout uh, if my opponent is expanding earlier to if he's making a command center here on the low ground. So that would be a good information to have. Ideally, I would like to get even double Stargate uh, on, on uh, two bases quickly. Can I fit a Stargate here? I think the Pylon might be just in a good enough place. But uh, no way of trying this. Okay, he's going back with the Reaper. Very quick, very quick. We actually want to... Yeah, I cannot really go out with the Adept right now, simply because if he can come in with the Reaper, come back. Now we can shade in, because we have Chronobus without the, the Adept. Okay, should I start Warp Gate? Oh, oh my god. Yeah, he's not letting me scout anything. <laughs> it's a bit of a shame. And okay, now we can scout. Uh, I will start Warp Gate just in case I need it later on into the series. Or in the, into the match, I should say, in the series. Okay, where's the Reaper now? This re this adept is actually so important to confirm what he's actually doing here. Come on, let me see. I don't want it to die. I I'm gonna shade forward right now with this adept. See if he's expanding. We're gonna have one void. Uh, well, I will not be able to see the expansion. Oh my god, I lose the, the adept. At least I can damage the, the Hellions. I can damage the Hellions, that's something. Uh, we need to make a full wall of here, really. Uh, the void is going to be useful, actually. The void is going to be useful. Oh wait, I forgot I don't have uh, my hotkeys here. I need to fix the hotkeys whenever there's a free moment here. Uh, I think the Hellions and the Rebus will not be able to do much here. Versus the battery. Oh, he's coming in. Okay. Okay, nice. He sees this. This is good. This is good. This is what I, what I needed. I take no damage whatsoever here. Okay, I would like to get a pylon though. I feel like I'm producing too many things at the same time. Let's get a second Stargate. To be honest, instead of the, uh, the Warp Gate, I think I should have gotten plus one. Let's see if I can find some damage now with the double Void Ray Harassment. I have batteries in both of my middle lines, so I'm not too afraid of uh, losing any anything, I think. The only problem could be a Widow Mind Drop, which I have nothing to deal with, of course, because I have no units. Let's see. Okay, we're moving out with the two Void Rays. And one more Pylon. Void Rays are very supply heavy as well. Four supply for... One Void Ray. The double opening from my opponent didn't really work out that great for him. Okay. Should I get a robotics facility? I wonder. Okay. What can we find here? Any Vikings or something? Absolutely nothing. There's nothing here. Is he like all inning or what? What is this? I'm afraid. He's definitely out on the map now. Kill the, kill the Viking? Oh, yes, yes. We were locked in. Locked in. Perfect. Get a Cyclone as well? Okay, this is very good. This is very good. Oh my god. There's one more Cyclone here. We don't want to go in range. I can still snipe it. 
Oh, there's more. No, 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 we cannot do this. Oh my god, I'm gonna lose this one. I'm gonna lose this one. He's gonna use the medivac maybe to chase this. Uh, I didn't see there's more more cyclones, uh, uh, but that's that was still good enough. Uh, this battery not necessary. He lost already enough. This void ray. Okay, me, maybe need to sneak in a, a base or something. We need a, a, a fleet beacon. We need a fleet beacon. That's for sure to get the fast void rays, the speedy guys. We actually, I actually need to pause for a moment. Need to fix the hotkey. Okay, we're back. Sorry, I, had, I really had to fix my hotkeys because. I didn't have them properly set up here. Okay. Uh, we have more Voidways coming out. I do need more pylons though. Now these three Voidways are going to be very hard for him to deal with. Actually, I do need a pylon, a secondary pylon to support this battery because... Sure, I have, uh, have a battery here, but if he kills the pylon, then there's no, no help from the battery then. Okay. Let's start to sneak in a third base. And the three Voidway is going to be very hard for him to... Oh, come on. He's already here. Let's work on some, some of this. He's not expecting the, the uh, counter-attack, I'm sure. We're gonna have plus one on these Voidias as well. Over here. Oh my god, there's two Vikings. Oh, this is fine, no? Kill this? Can I kill this? It's gonna be close. We have plus one. Ah, uh, he has a third base already. Not that easy. Kill this, okay. Yeah, that was worse than I expected it to be for me. Gonna be honest. I have to kill the Vikings. Here. Okay. Don't heal up. The Cyclones are so annoying. Okay. He has a free basis already done, though. Forge. Maybe get a, a Nexus. How many Vikings? I think. Oh, I don't think he's producing more Vikings, right? I'm not sure what happened to the other trade, but we have Speedy Voidways now. We have Speedy Voidways. We need to get to the Colossus now. Slowly, slowly but surely. Uh, he didn't lose that, that many Sacna. With the Speedy Void, this is gonna be harder for him to, to deal with uh, the harassment. Simply because he doesn't have Stim yet, right? He just finished the Barracks, so... There's a good chance we will find some damage to these Voidways. If... If he has no Vikings in position. Let's see, where's the first... I don't want... Uh, uh, his cast is already taken at this base. He's absolutely winning this game very, very hard. Can I kill the stem or something? Or kill the Vikings? Okay, this is good. This is good. Uh, kill the stem and combat shield. Okay, this is good. He's not gonna see this. Okay, this is good. Kill the medivax, maybe? Go here. We don't need uh, super. Look at this. The speedy void race, man. Speedy void race. Let's go. Kill the medivac if possible. Maybe I can kill this. Get the uh, gases here. Come on. Void race, void race. This is good. One more Stargate. Okay, maybe kill some Marines here with plus one. Kill some here. Go back to mining. Need to find some damage here before he has stem. Remember, he has no stem because we killed the, uh, the tech lab. He has two in engineering base here as well. There's lots of medivacs. There's still some stuff here. We can kill the e-base, so he has no 2-1. Two, 2-2. Two one. Two, two. Uh, sorry, 1-1. One, one. Can go here. Kill the e-base. It's good. Look at this! Oh my god! <laughs> Double from uh, Voider Harassment. Never thought I would see the day. Kill the many backs if possible. Okay, we killed one. Oh no, no, we're losing the Voiders. Losing too many of them! Please don't die, don't die! Oh my god, he died. Okay, at least I saturated this base. Okay. This was definitely a successful harassment. However, I still lost some Voiders to that. And he was still happily mining with his SCVs. But I cannot really complain on this because I think it, it went as, as good as it possibly could. Go here. We may, maybe need a, an immortal or something. We have lots of void rays. Oh. Kill the Viking. Oh, shit! Oh, he has so much. He actually has so much. The battery here. Where's my... Uh, oh, my robot voice. Very far off. Very far off. The tank is gonna be very hard for, for me to deal with. We killed the E-base, though. Is he gonna drop? There's no way he's gonna drop, right? You probably need disruptors now. Is he coming this way? Okay. The cyclone. This is good. Please don't die. Don't lose the void. Rate. Don't lose the void. Rate. Okay. This is something. Okay. With Robo Bay done. Maybe I need to counter attack. No. The cyclone. Nice. We have plus one these void rays now. Very helpful. Very helpful. Need to get rid of the siege tank. Get some Vikings dead. This is good. 
Very good, very good, very, very good traits. We're not letting him siege, uh, siege us. Now we need to counter attack. We need to counter attack. Go, go, go. I don't think he's gonna try to break for. Wait, is he? Wait, he's trying. He's still trying. Oh, there's the siege tanks. Uh, it's gonna take him a while though. Breakthrough. Maybe, maybe I actually do need to counter attack. Maybe this is the, the only play that I have. Maybe if I attack from behind the, the siege tanks. Go, go. We need to kill that base. Or something. Okay, this is a good shot. Good shot. We, we kill two. Okay, we're killing the base. I'm not sure if we can really kill much here. Okay, he cannot kill this, that's for sure. Come on, disruptor, we gotta survive. We gotta kill some stuff here. Kill the Vikings. Okay, do you have the disruptor? I still have. Come on, survive, please, buddy. No. So I'm gonna win. Okay. On this, this. Maybe some Tempest? Some batteries? We're killing like everything here. That's for sure, which is really nice. I still need to recall though. There's a lot of Marines here. He kills a lot of stuff. Do not let him get to the main. Oh, he's coming in. Let's go. Void race? I believe in you. No? Not quite. Now we're somewhat winning? No? Come on, battery overcharge. Wait, 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 wait. It's not over. We have plus two. I still have some probes. Please don't lose the plus three, don't lose the plus three. Come on, Voidus. Oh my god. Don't tell me I'm winning. We might be winning. I still have 14 probes here. I didn't lose the natural. Okay, go, 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 come on. Oh my god, please. Oh, he's gonna have so many tourists, but he lifted the, 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 the production facilities. I think we got it. We just have to go. We just have to go. Oh my goodness. Come on. This will be the greatest victory ever. Producing. He's losing some marines. Fine. How many do you have? Gotta kill all of them. Medivacs? Nice! Okay. We're gonna leave two, two voiders here. And we're, we're going to the mains. We gotta kill the, 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 the productions. Something, anything. He's producing here as well. Vikings. Go! Let's go! Oh my god! That's right! That is right! Oh, the mass Voidry victory versus Terran. The base hit was actually the right choice. Oh, I cannot believe this. Absolute insanity. <laughs> the Voidries are really fun to play with, but they're really, really hard to make work. Oh my god, what a game. What a match. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> the upgrades. Wait, he actually did have plus two? He actually had two, two. He actually already had two, two upgrades, despite me sniping the double engineering bay here. That is absolutely insane, man. Oh, I love it. Love it. Ah, we got a quitter. We got a quitter. Quitter. All right. No, non quitter now. <laughs> we got another Zerg player. Well, I want to say another because the previous guy that quit was actually a Zerg player. So we're playing versus Alex. And then Mr. Alex, I'm so sorry, but you're going to get mass void right here. This is the idea here. But I'm not sure if I should be sorry because the Zergs are actually them. Uh, pretty damn good versus the Voidus. They have Queens! And Queens are pretty damn good versus Voidus, but they don't have that much uh, aggressive potential versus the Voidus, I think. The problem with the ma playing Mass Voidus, I think, versus Zerg mostly comes down to... Uh, it it's hard to stop the Zerg from growing, you know? Like, you, you, you're pretty much safe against everything. I mean, some Zerg can do, like, Queen Walk or maybe Nidus and so on. But I think it's very hard to stop the Zerg from, from growing. Oh, yes, he got the hatchery. In here and once the zerg is growing they can get to the like vipers mass amount of queens and then the voiders are actually a problem then I've, that's when you want to add high tempos for that that's for sure all right what are you up to mr alex let me entertain you here for a moment with my probe gotta make sure that your opponents are warmed up guys look at this he's actually microing the drones quite well look at this he's coming back to mining i see warm up your fingers alex you're in for a, you are in for a treat of a game he has a Kerrigan, Queen of Blades portrait as well. I don't have these decals, by the way. Not sure why. 
actually not much of a skin guy when it comes to you know cosmetics i don't like using skins even when i play like moba mobas are like i don't know any other game that has skins in it even sarka i really don't like using skins for some reason it's not like i'm against skins but this doesn't change much for me for example in starcraft 2 there was one skin or maybe it's still there i'm not sure if it's still being used that often but there was there's this like uh very dark skin for protoss i, I believe it's like tal darim skin or something where the stalkers and the immortals look very much so alike and it's very hard to dis distinguish them in the in the heat of the moment and luckily in the tournaments there there's an option that uh, only the, the the fans actually see the skins and players do not I think that's one of the best changes out there, because I don't want to watch their skins that much. Okay, let's see. This guy's hovering here. The Overlord is going for third base relatively quickly. And go here with the... Oh, yes, already links here. Think of my prop. Can I see if he's making a Nexus? Uh, nexus? Not, not Nexus. Hatchery. To confirm that, this is good. Now, one thing that I need to worry about... Uh, I will actually start with plus one super quickly here. Extremely quickly. Actually, with, before Warp it completely. I will see with this uh, adept if he's making more drones or links. It's a very important scout for me. Because then I know uh, if I see a lot of drones, I should not be worried about a potential link flood or bane links or something. The reason why I keep my defenses open right now is the link speed is not going to finish up until like 15 seconds from now. And uh, it will already give me information. If I see link speeds or like, uh, you know, list, little bit of drones only in the natural base, I can fully wall in. I should be far, fine. Yeah, normal, normal drone car. He has some eggs here, but... I should not be worried here. He's gonna lose this Overlord very quickly to the first Void Ray, which means that I can safely go to take a third base without him knowing about that, probably. Hopefully. Okay, we're gonna go. We actually do need a Pylon here to not get supply. But there's one more Overlord here. We can probably chase down. This is fantastic. Okay. Free picking for this Void Ray. All good. Now we need to make sure that we don't lose the third base to potential Link run by. There could be one as well, as I'm actually moving out with the Void Ray. Just to... Snipe this Overlord that we saw retreating. I need to get the gases going. We have a Forge on the way. I need to make a cannon at my third base. And a second Stargate. Oh, look at this. Yeah, that's the links I was talking about. So let's just go back with the Void Ray. He's making more links. More and more links. He probably wants to cancel this base. Yeah, he's gonna maybe succeed in doing so. It's not gonna be easy. He's going for the pylon, which is a good thing for me. Because I don't mind losing the pylon, I would mind losing the nexus. Let's get a battery here, just in case he wants to... Like, this guy looks very, looks very aggressive. I wonder if he's gonna go for a nidus. Looks like he wants to sni snipe the third base a bit later. Because he killed the pylon and he retreated. Which makes me think that he wants to prevent me from building batteries or cannons here, so... I'm a bit worried here, not gonna lie. At least we have a third base done. Let's get one more pylon here. He's retreated. I don't see anything here. I would like to live long enough to get a cannon here in my third base. We already have plus one on the Void Ray, so the Voids are actually capable of winning fights versus Queens right now. Of course, ideally without Queens uh, having Transfuse. Let's build a cannon here. I would like to see if he has a Lair or not. Okay, Void Race. No fourth base for you here, maybe at the top. Oh, there's a... There's a straight Queen. Oh, oh wait. He has Overlord Speed. No Transfuse on these Queens, by the way. I see that. They have not enough energy. Which makes me think that he wants to make a Nidus push. A uh, uh, queen, queen Walk push. Why would you have the qu uh, link, uh, Queen Overlord speed? Right? Otherwise. Makes no sense. Okay. Let's go back. I'd like to see if he's making a third base. How many units he has. One more Overlord. Let's kill this one. He's making more links. Yeah, he's definitely attacking us. Look at this. He's making Queen push. Wait. I lost the Void Race. I lost the void to the queens. Oh shit. No, 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 no. You cannot do that. Not allow that to happen. There we go. Cancel. Need to make more cannons and batteries here. I'm not going to survive this if it goes long enough. I need one, maybe a cannon here. On this base. We need to snipe the overlord that's transporting the queens. If possible. Where is he? There's a lot of links. I need to spot the overlord. Where is it? Let's get a third Stargate. It's only links here. Links are not gonna break through this cannon now. We have good wall with the probes here as well. And the battery supporting this. This is good. Exactly what I need. Okay, I do need a, ro a Robo for a potential Hydra. 
transition as well. I need the fleet beacon for... Oh, there's, there we go. There's the queens. Let's kill the overlords. We should be fine. Okay, we killed... Oh, I lost one body, but that's okay. Make a wall off for the... So the Zerlin is going to do much here. Okay, the cannons are in a very good position. This is a big all in by my opponent. I remember, he cannot transfuse these. Unless he has creep, but he still has one more void right here. Is there one more... Overlord there, but we, we have a very good wall off. Let's just hold position the probes. So it's harder for him to walk in here. Look at this. Perfect wall here. Hold position these void ways. I'm losing some probes. Super battery is extremely helpful here. Let's not lose this. I lost ma majority of my probes. I lost one void ray. Okay, we have cannons here. He cannot break through the cannons. Uh, I third stargate. Let's go. Oh, I lost another void ray. I have not enough shield batteries here. I'm a bit afraid. We can use transfuse still. If I can snipe one of these queens that is full energy, it'll be fantastic before losing a void ray. Oh, oh, he's going in! A mistake! He tried to be fancy with the micro, but... Let's go! This is a good hold. This was a good hold. If it wasn't for my Sim City here, I would have lost this game. Because it's actually a very difficult uh, hold after I lost two void rays here, uh, as I was retreating with them. So I had minus two void rays. He also had a lot of queens here. Did I kill any queens into the uh, in the overlords? I wonder. I don't think so, because he had a lot of them. He had uh, five, seven queens in total. And I killed the overlord. Now, every single queen uh, unloaded out of the overlords. Interesting. So I didn't have that much of a uh, of an advantage, even after sp uh, sniping these overlords. Clutch hold. Really clutch hold with the, with the formation. Just take a look how his units are clumping up. Right here, as he's attacking with the links, right? Everything is like trying to attack the cannons and the adept. The probes are on hold position, so they are just blocking. They are not a threat to the Zerglings, so the Zerglings are not target firing in here. Onto the probes. And the super battery, extremely, extremely helpful. Well done, GG. Awesome. An all matchup episode as we are playing versus a Protoss player, Nua. From. I, I, don't, I don't remember which episode, but we did play him. Not long ago, and I did say that Noah is French for Shadow, but you guys uh, fixed that and said that it's not Shadow, but it is Black. So I'm curious to see. Wait, actually, let's go low ground, high ground, high ground, high ground, high ground. We need to go high ground, pile on the gateway, then try to defend uh, one gate expand with Void Rays. Possibly if he wants to go for one base all in. I'm not sure. Actually, can I go double gateway opening? Need to void this, it feels like a big mistake. Big waste as well. Go double gate if you want to go for mass voidus in PvP. Like playing mass voidus in PvP can be good once you get to the like to a certain mass and like you're saturated on free bases. I think getting to free bases might be the most difficult part of playing mass voidus in PvP. Because that's when the, the, the number of voidus is relatively small. That's when the blink timings uh, hit you and they can just snipe voidus left and right and, and grow at the same time. But this is something that I will have to be careful of. Maybe I can get myself an, a single oracle to do some stasis traps or uh, and some. Possible. Okay, let's go here. Make a second spine. Okay, double gateway opening from my opponent. Double gas. Okay, very standard so far. There's the cybernetic score. Slightly faster than mine. But that's okay. We basically have to be a little max packs here for a brief moment. Try to go for one gate expand. Okay, looks like there's a second pylon here in the main base, which is a good thing for us, because that means that there's no blind cheese from my opponent. That's always going to be a good thing if you're going for one gate expand. Okay, do I need to finish the zealot? Possibly, I think I need to finish the zealot, right? In case he wants to block the nexus. Looks like he's not blocking the nexus, though. Maybe he's doing it on purpose. I'm gonna stay here. Stay here with the zealot, go for a very quick target. We need that. Oh, he's actually blocking my probe here. This is interesting. You can maybe block the probe from coming out. Okay. One, two. It's good. He's not gonna make a nexus. Uh, sorry, uh, not gonna make a pylon here, right? Okay, that's good. Alright. He's actually attacking his own battery because that's what he likes. He's making a sentry. Okay, sentry is actually perfect for us. Then we don't need warp Okay, I mean, I'm gonna need maybe one oracle to keep him occupied. And this is what we'll do. Let's go here. Attack with the Void Ray. And a, uh, sorry, an Oracle and a Zealot. I need the Pylon though, I forgot about the Pylon. My bad. But I, because I lost the prop on the other side of the map, it should be just fine. We need to confirm if this is a expansion. Oh, wait, what? There's a Stalker. 
That's something you see every day. A sentry stalker like that, okay. Maybe this is a fake. This could be a fake. Uh, I, I need to see if he's expanding or not. This setup has to give me that information. Come on, buddy. Oh. Okay, I, th I think he's coming back to the socket. That means he's expanding. Okay, uh, I saw a hallucination as well. That's triple sentry. Oh, I didn't mean to finish this. Ah, that's a mistake. That's a mistake. That's okay. A little bit of, bit of hope for my opponent, really. That's what I'm doing here. Okay, he sees I'm making a void ray. I need the gases, though. I need... Plus one. I don't necessarily need the warp cube, but I'm gonna finish it no matter what, because it's so close to completion anyway. I don't want to show him the second Stargate now, though. Okay, he finished the horror... Uh, the... Oh, we can get some probes here. One, two, nice. Three? That's good. That is good. That's what we needed. Okay. Okay. Get the second Void Ray. Let's get plus one. Now, this Orko is going to keep him occupied for the longest time, that's for sure. He can't really walk out on the map that quickly. He has that Twilight Cancel, though. I need to be kind of careful. Oh, he's moving out with lots of Stalkers. Oh, yeah, I have no battery. Shit. I have no battery. Here, ready. I might just straight up die to it. Okay, there's still four Stalkers here. Yeah, we're okay. We're just moving out with this. Uh, this might be hallucinated Stalkers, maybe? I'm not sure. I don't like where this is going. I need a zealot back. One. Uh, that's a lot of hallucinated stalkers here, by the way. I see that. Okay, it's good. This is a real stalker. This was not a fake. It's okay. We can just pull props here. This is a real stalker. He's gonna recall, maybe? Okay, all good. No harm done here. Tell me. Wait, wait, hello? Where, where are these stalkers going? I have two voiders here, bro. What was that? What was this movement? Okay, I like I like I didn't mind him going up the ramp. But this this was not it, Chief. It was not it. Well, that gives me uh, enough uh, time to tech up. To the second target. I do need a f I mean I did lose some probes, so it's not like completely for free. Uh, he's still making blink. He has blink already. Please don't die, please don't die, please, 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 please. Oh, yeah. How is this even a thing? We need to nerf the stalker range. Okay, well, this is not good then for me. This is still not very good. There's a much faster third base. If I can find some damage with the void, that will be fantastic. The moment I see stalkers out on the map, maybe there's a chance for me to do some counter attack with. Oh, look at this. Exactly, just like that. Now he cannot attack the zealot because there's a, there's a blind spot here, by the way. He cannot attack it. It's super annoying. Okay, uh, the void is gonna come here. Look at this. The zealot is invincible for a moment. Oh, this is good. This is good. This gives me some time. I will probably lose the third base, but I think he's gonna lose much more for that. We can kill the battery here. He's gonna warp in some stalkers or recall. Let's see what he does. What does he do? He's not recalling. He's not recalling. Let's uh, kill this. We're fine. We have plus, uh, plus one attack here. We should be fine here. Okay, kill the gateway. He has to recall now. He's recalling. I need to recall as well. Come on, come on, please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. I didn't get the... Uh, I didn't lose the third base, which is a good thing for me. This little bought me enough time, actually, which is very good. Okay, now I have enough voiders to fight, I think. The stalkers. Uh, what is this, six? We can fight some of them, half of them, before he commits the rest, but... Let's see. Is he bringing them here? He's gonna blink on top. Oh, that's too much. That is too much for me. I need Zelda to tank this damage. Okay. What? He's blinking in? No, wait, this is a good move. Man, this talk is just destroyed. I wonder if he's going for a DT or something. Okay, well, we both have no recall now, and I delayed his production by a bit. We're gonna have... We're gonna have uh, the speedy voidway soon-ish. Oh, 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 look at this. Is he coming to the middle? Come here, come here, come here, boy. That's right. Let's blink. But actually, now I he saw, he knows my position of the void is. Okay. We need to chill for just a moment. We need to chill for a moment. I need a robo. In case he goes for actually DTs or like Archons or something. Right now we are sur surviving. We're in a definitely a good spot, playable spot. But still, we're playing with mass void ways, so... Gotta be extremely careful. How, do, how, how far along I have a recall? I need 40 seconds. 
for recall. That's enough time for me to cross the map with the Void Race. I will have Speedy Void in just a moment as well. Maybe I can find some more damage here. I need triple Stargate, I feel like. Triple, maybe even Quad Stargate. I like what he's doing with the probe here. Go here, let's get the mining going. Go here, take a fourth. With speed of Look at this here, actually. <laughs> this zealot man is so annoying. But I spotted the stalkers now. Can kill some stalkers here. Good. He's gonna blink. Let's go back. Go back. He's gonna blink. Oh, I lost the Voidry. Uh, that's not good. That's what I wanted. We can kill the fourth, maybe. No, no fourth. Okay. What do you do? Where are you with the stalkers? He's here? He's here and here. Okay. This is too much. But we can fight this. Ooh. You can see this one coming. Okay, go back. Please don't lose only one. Oh my god, there's so many. Yeah, I'm gonna stay here. I'm gonna stay here. I cannot do this. Uh, I need an immortal for that. I need an immortal. That's so many stalkers he has. He's moving out. Go here. La la la. Oh my god, he still has stalkers here. Nicely. I, I saw him moving out here in the middle, but I gotta recall this. I have too much. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. I don't think he has a lot here. We can chase him a bit. Oh, this is too much for me. Yeah, again? Okay, we gotta go back. We gotta go back. He's blinking in now. Again. Not sure about this. Uh, come on, but Batteries. With plus two soon. Okay, we survived. Okay, we're alive. We are alive. We have plus two now on the void race. I swear! He's going here around. Need some batteries. I would like to get a cannon here as well. An observer. Okay. What's up, bro? Okay, we can fight this. We can definitely fight this. We have plus two. No? Am I wrong? Oh, come on. Oh my god, the stalkers are so annoying. Okay, with more voiders coming, it's fine. I need a forge. I, I cannot win without cannons here. I think. Oh, get a, get observer. Nice. Actually, I didn't get it. He has plus two here as well. Uh, at least I survived to all the batteries. Eight plus three. Uh, I don't like where this is going. Really, I really don't. Mm. There's a lot of stalkers still. I have only five void rays. Gonna blink in again. I have a feeling. Okay, this is a good, more, uh, better fight for me this time though. There's a lot of uh, stalkers dead. Okay. Come on. Just a little bit more. We can do this. This has an observer. I need uh, cannons now. It's not an easy game for me whatsoever. I didn't start plus three. Shit. He's gonna attack us soon with like multiple directions, I think. The fact that I have a fourth is really good for me though. Oh, there he is. That's not enough stalkers. He's gonna attack me the fourth at the same time? Maybe? Go. Oh. Okay. We're chasing him. Okay, this is enough. That's enough of a chase. Go here with a stalker. Cannon battery. Try to get a fourth. It's looking good. Get the pylon. There's an observer still here. I see it. He has a couple of zealots there. He has to flank me, right? I think. How much do you have? How many stalkers? This is not enough stalkers. Not enough stalkers, bro! Oh my good. Let's go. We can chase. 
That's not enough. Go, 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 go. Micro. We'll try to blink in again. That's not enough stalkers. We can fight. We have plus two attack here. Voidus are so good in this situation. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my god. What a set of victories today. What a set of victories. He was actually on five bases. With the Ridge Vespin Geyser as well, 71 probes. I think if I wouldn't have counterattacked right now, eventually he would be he would outgrow me. But I found the perfect timing to counterattack him. I spotted the, uh, the the amount of stalkers that I had. And I made the, the, the judgment call to actually fight with the Void Race without a battery overcharge, without immortals or anything. Actually, pure Void Race. Right there. And another victory. Ah, love it. Absolutely love it. Good stuff, good stuff. And with this beautiful victory, I'm gonna finish this episode of uh, Mass Void Race. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We had all victories in all three different matches. The perfect episode, one would say. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video. Let me know in the comment section how you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next episode of whatever I upload. Mass Void Race are still pretty damn good.